Yes, I, um, 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 many times in, uh, in a school festival, I love in a school festival and the Romanian, Romanian uh, audience, they are big music lovers. And this is, this is a fantastic, beautiful hall here, Romanian Athenaeum. And again, being here is great for me. I've been as a composer, as a pianist in this hall, and I really hope to continue every time in Romania to play, give my concerts, give my new works for Romanian audience. Do you know your concert was sold out in 20 minutes? This is good. This <laughs> is uh, very... Uh, I'm honored to hear this. I didn't know this. I mean, uh, Romania is... Um, in culturally known by this festival. Romania is an ESCO festival, so we, from, you know, international mm, arts are seeing Romania is, they have an ESCO festival, and they have composer like Enescu, great composer, and dedicated a festival to Enescu. So everybody internationally knows this. This is great. Can you tell us just a few words about your repertoire tonight? With a full hall for sure. Yeah, it's a very nice uh, repertoire beginning with Debussy music, very famous Five Preludes and the Claire de Lune. And then I do my own compositions. New Life Sonata is a pandemic piece, pandemic times piece, and Black Earth and my ballads or so. And then comes Appassionata of Beethoven, which is a very famous, difficult and virtuoso uh, and dramatic piece. And in the end, we end the concert today with Bach. And I think it's a good idea. I first time end a concert with Bach, and I want to try it here in Athenaeum in Bucharest. Uh, so uh, this is a late uh, evening concert. We begin at 10.30, so finish at 12 o'clock. So I think people should go home and sleep with Bach. Do you remember your first contact with George Enescu's music? Yeah, uh, I love, of course, you know, and um, I'm Turkish and Romanian music and Turkish music has so much similarities in DNA of folklore, rhythms, and this uh, Eastern European Balkanic rhythms in the music and such a similarity and of course Enescu music is very much uh, close to our music and Turkish people love Enescu that's why so maybe an idea now uh, next time I come I should play Enescu music Talking about Enescu and using folklore or Romanian themes in his music, you use um, Turkish. A lot of Turkish instruments and uh, legends and history. Yes, I'm a composer telling stories with my music, telling, uh, you know, persons, cities in Turkey uh, or political events and, and all these demonstrations. And I make with my music a comment to my life and what I see in my country, in the world. So this is uh, how I, how the life and the world inspires me in Turkey. I think Enescu was similar to react uh, the world and his country in a way. Do you, do you think you sometimes take a risk by commenting through your <laughs> music? Yeah, but uh, life is good if you take risk, I think. Uh, of course, in life we have sometimes problems um, and, you know, it's difficult to speak about all this. But I am for the freedom and 21st century should be a human free, people should be free. Everyone, our children should have a free life and nice life. So and we should protect this planet and we should make very much work for the uh, ecological situation in this planet. And of course, uh, countries like Turkey, we have to work on democratic 
uh, speeches. Uh, do you think uh, music and artists like you have a role in this turmoil that we are living? Look, I mean, we have a role. We, we can succeed things. I mean, I, I give um, concerts sometimes in mountains in Turkey and we can save, uh, you know, disasters of natural, um, for nature, saving nature, saving, they cut the forests or uh, trees, all this. So um, music is answering and stopping sometimes the bad ideas of politicians. I think the sound of music is not only sound, but is life. It's our life, it's our blood, our thinkings, our feelings. That's the generosity. And we shouldn't do just, you know, playing perfect a piece of Beethoven or Mozart. No, we should live with it, feel it, and, and, and trust and make the people show it like a picture, like a movie, you know. I, this, that's how I understand generosity. Do you have a ritual when you compose? Some writers just sit every day and write a few pages. Do you have that? Uh, no, um, I, as you know, I'm composing and playing piano since I'm a child, since I'm five years old. So, uh, depends of my schedule and what uh, is coming to me if I have to concerts and practice for the concert repertoire, or sometimes I have free time and uh, enjoy the um, working on new piece, creating always. I compose every year three, four bigger pieces. So, uh, and also there are co commission works of big festivals and orchestras. Maybe we should do also a Romanian uh, music of mine. It is a good idea. How does it feel for a composer to listen to his compositions played by other that's yeah, great. Uh, everybody plays different. Every orchestra plays different. I, um, I think um, if you write music um, understandable for the conductor, for the orchestra musicians, they will do exactly what composer wants. So that's why um, many times in Enesco Festival is also concerts without me, with my music, like the Istanbul Symphony or in two weeks, we have water piano concerto played by a great Romanian pianist, Alexandra. So, uh, I'm represented uh, two, twice, as a composer and myself as a pianist.